to find VC of T by means of Laplace transform. So first, let's analyze the circuit at T less than zero. So at T less than zero, so assuming that at T less than zero, the circuit was in a steady state. So we have 10 volts, 10 the inductor is shorted, we have capacitor, then the capacitor is open circuit. So by VDT, we can solve for the initial, uh, we can solve for the value of VC, 0 minus, is equal to, to 5 over 5 plus 15 which is 20 times 10 equal to 2.5 volts. Then our IL of 0 minus by Ohm's law is just equal to 10 over 15 plus 5. We have 10 over 20 is equal to 0 0.5 ampere. We have now our initial values. So now let's analyze our, circ our circuit at T greater than 0. So at T greater than 0, we have so 10 U of T is uh, activated. Our source here is now 20. Now converting this to time domain, we have 20 over S we have 2.5 S here is with a voltage source the value of 2.5 times the initial value IL we have 1.25 Five. And let's use the equivalent circuit for the capacitor. So we have one hundred over S parallel with a current source with a magnitude of zero point zero two five. So this is T times VC of 0 minus. We have our VC here. We can uh, further simplify the circuit. We can combine these two voltage sources. So, there's a value of 1.25 S plus 20 over S. And we have the 5 parallel with 100 over S, which is equivalent to 100 over S plus 20 parallel with current source. This is our VC. Two point five S. Applying TCL at VC, node VC, you can get expression the expression of VC. So TCL at VC, we have VC minus one point. 25s plus 20 over s all over all over we have 
2.5s plus 15 plus we have vc over 100 over s plus 20 minus 0 0.025 equal to 0 equivalent to vc over 2.5s plus 15 minus 1.25s plus 20 over s times 2.5s plus 15 plus s plus 20 vc over 100 minus 0 0.025 equals to 0. So combining like terms, we have 2.5 over 100. So our expression for VC is equal to 2.5 S squared plus 26s plus 320 over s and we can factor this out with s plus 16 and s plus 10 so using partial fractions this is equal to a over s plus b over s plus 6 plus C over S plus N. So solving for the values of A, B, and C, we have 2.5 S squared plus 6 S plus 320 equal to A times S plus 16 times S plus 10 times B, S times s plus 10 plus cs times s plus 10. So assigning values a different values for s we can solve for a b and c so if s is equal to 0 we can solve for the value of a so where a just equivalent to 5. now if S is equal to negative 16. We can solve for the value of B. The value of B equal to 4.1667. And lastly, if S is equal to negative 10, we can solve for the value of C, which is equal to negative 6.6667. So VC is just equal to 5 over S plus 4.1667 over S plus 16 minus. 6.6667 over s plus 10. Converting this into time domain, we're getting the inverse Laplace. We have 5 plus 4.1667 e to the negative infinity minus 6.6667 e to the negative 10t times u of t. 